With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, let's start the question. The question says that question 1, if y power 1 by m plus y power minus 1 by m equal to 2x, then prove that x square minus 1 into d square y by dx square plus x into dy by dx minus m square y equal to 0. Question 2, if y equal to ln x plus one, root 1 plus x square, then prove that 1 plus x square into d square y by dx square plus x into dy by dx equal to 0. So, here we have two questions which we need to prove. So, we'll start from the first part. That is y power 1 by m plus y power minus 1 by m equal to 2x. So, here we'll differentiate with respect to x. So, differentiating we will get here. Differentiation of y power 1 by m will be 1 by m y power 1 by m minus 1 into dy by dx plus differentiation of y power minus 1 by m will be minus 1 by m y power minus 1 by m minus 1 into dy by dx equal to differentiation of 2x will be so, here we will take dy by dx as common and 1 by m as common. So, here y power 1 by m minus 1, we can split and write as y power 1 by m into y power minus 1 minus again we can split here and write it as y power minus 1 by m into y power minus 1 equal to 2. So, here we can see that y power minus 1 is common. So, we will take it out and write dy by dx 1 by, so y power minus 1 is nothing but 1 by y. So, this will be 1 by m y into y power 1 by m minus y power minus 1 by m equal to 2. So, here now we will cross multiply and write this as y power 1 by m minus y power minus 1 by m dy by dx equal to 2 m y. Now we will square on both sides. So squaring on both sides. So upon squaring this will be y power 1 by m minus y power minus 1 by m whole square and this will be dy by dx whole square equal to square of 2my whole square will be 4m square y square and here this is of the form a minus b whole square so we can apply the identity a minus b whole square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2ab so upon expanding this will be y power 2 by m plus y power minus 2 by m minus 2 into y power 1 by m y power minus 1 by m dy by dx whole square is equal to 4m square y square. Then we have the formula of exponents that is a power m into a power n is equal to a power m plus n. So using this we can write here y power 2 by m plus y power minus 2 by m minus 2 into so we will use this law over here since the bases are same. So this will be y power 1 by m minus 1 by m dy by dx whole square is equal to 4 m square y square. So, here we can see y power 1 by m minus 1 by m this becomes y power 0 and we know that anything to the power 0 x power 0 will be equal to 1. So, that value becomes 1. So, here we can write y power 2 by m plus y power minus 2 by m minus 2 dy by dx whole square is equal to 4 m square y square. So, we will take this as equation 1. Now we know from the question that y power 1 by m plus y power minus 1 by m is equal to 2x. This is given to us. So now we will square this on both sides. So squaring on both sides this will become y power 2 by m plus y power minus 2 by m plus 2 into y power 1 by m 
into y power minus 1 by m because this will be a plus b whole square form equal to 2x whole square this will be 4x square now again we have this y power 1 by m into y power minus 1 by m we have proved above that it becomes equal to 1 so this will be y power 2 by m plus y power minus 2 by m plus 2 equal to 4x square so rearranging this will be y power 2 by m plus y power minus 2 by m equal to 4x square minus 2 we'll take this as equation 2 so here we have the value of y power 2 by m plus y power minus 2 by m. We can substitute it in 1. So we will write put value of 2 in equation 1. So when we substitute this will be 4x square minus 2 and then we have minus 2 again dy by dx whole square is equal to 4m square y square. So here this will be 4x square minus 4 into dy by dx whole square equal to 4m square y square. Now both the sides we have 4 as common so we can cancel that. So this will be x square minus 1 dy by dx whole square equal to m square y square. Now again we will differentiate with respect to x. So differentiate with respect to x. So here we will use uv rule of differentiation that is duv by dx is equal to u into dv by dx plus v into du by dx. So using this now here u is x square minus 1 and v is dy by dx whole square. So we will have x square minus 1. And differentiation of dy by dx whole square will be 2 into dy by dx into d square y by dx square plus now keeping dy by dx whole square as constant differentiation of x square minus 1 will be 2x equal to here we are m square y square. So m square is a constant term. So m square into differentiation of y square will be 2y dy by dx. So here we can take 2 dy by dx as common. So we will have x square minus 1 into d square y by dx square plus x dy by dx equal to m square 2y dy by dx. So dy by dx gets cancelled on both the side. 2 gets cancelled on both the side. So now we will have x square minus 1 d square y by dx square plus x dy by dx and we will bring the right side term to the left. So this will be minus m square y equal to 0. So thus this is the term which we had to prove according to our question. So we can say hence prove. Now we will move on to the second part of the question that is second is y equal to ln x plus square root of 1 plus x square. So here we will differentiate with respect to x. So differentiate with respect to x. So differentiating this will be dy by dx is equal to. So differentiation of land will be 1 by x plus square root of 1 plus x square into differentiation of x will be 1 plus differentiation of square root of 1 plus x square will be 1 by 2 root 1 plus x square and differentiation of x square will be 2x. So here 2 gets cancelled. So dy by dx will be equal to 1 by x plus square root of 1 plus x square into here we will take LCM. So LCM is square root of 1 plus x square and here we will have square root of 1 plus x square plus x. So square root of 1 plus x square plus x we can cancel it. So we will get dy by dx equal to 1 by square root of 1 plus x square. So we will take this as 1. Now this can be written as dy by dx equal to 1 plus x square power minus half in the power form. So now we will differentiate this again. So differentiate with respect to x. So differentiating we will get 
d square y by dx square is equal to so here differentiation of 1 plus x square power minus half this will be minus half 1 plus x square power minus half minus 1 into differentiation of x square that is 2x so here 2 gets cancelled now d square y by dx square is equal to minus x into 1 plus x square we can split this and write as power minus half into 1 plus x square power minus 1 so d square y by dx square is equal to minus x this 1 plus x square power minus 1 we can write it down as 1 plus x square into 1 plus x square power minus half so we'll rearrange and write this so this will be d square y by dx square plus x into 1 plus x square for minus half by 1 plus x square equal to 0. Now we will multiply this term multiply by 1 plus x square. So upon multiplying this will become d square y by dx square into 1 plus x square plus x into 1 plus x square power minus half equal to 0. But from equation 1 we have 1 plus x square minus half power is equal to dy by dx. So we can replace it with that. So we can write this as d square y by dx square into 1 plus x square plus x into dy by dx equal to 0. So this we replaced it from equation 1. So this is what we had to prove according to the question. Thus we can write hence proved. Thus we can conclude therefore question 1 and 2 are proved. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.